And bags didn't stand a chance today against the heavy rain as it poured in Orange County. Water flooded streets and gushed into businesses, causing some serious damage and some major headaches. Kikonine's Hermela Aragawi is now live in Costa Mesa, where businesses there and owners are getting their first look at that damage tonight. Hermela? Good evening. That's right. You see this line right here? That is how far the water came up. So we're talking about almost six feet from street level, and it carried cars like this casually floating into the street and eventually onto the sidewalk. But it didn't stop here. It rushed into those businesses over there and left the owners with a huge mess. All right, let's get this TV. In Costa Mesa tonight, a massive cleanup. Roy Mendren says water came rushing into his shop early afternoon and tore through expensive electronic equipment. We uh, saw it start rising, and the water literally flowed in from both both the front and the back. And we just started shoveling water out. We were just trying to put sandbags and stop it, and there was nothing we could do. And he says he's looking at about seventy-five thousand dollars in damage. I don't know. A little anxiety. You know, trying to figure out how I'm going to figure this all out. Next door, Ted Boyko's bike repair shop fared a bit better, but also had nearly a foot of water rip through. Started getting sandbags naturally first thing, and sandbag the front, the back, trying to subside the water from coming in. It didn't do anything. It was coming that quick. Boyko says this is the first time in 10 years he's seen anything like this. This was uh, a flood that came out of nowhere. I've been caught off guard all day and ready to cry. It was an incredible scene across Orange County as four inches of rain turned the roads into a sea of floating cars on Balboa Island, which is prone to flooding, but also in Costa Mesa, where a lot of residents say they were caught off guard. I didn't expect anything. I got the alert on the phone about flash flood warnings, but I get those all the time, and I've never thought anything about it. And, um, Apparently, this time uh, proved me wrong. A lot of cleanup ahead for these business owners. They say they didn't have flood insurance because they didn't think that they would need it. So that's something that they say that they are concerned about. Reporting live in Costa Mesa, Hermel Aragawi, KCAL 9 News.